do and all. So I've been off work today, not of my own choice. I've uh, had a poorly boy, my youngest, so I've just dropped him back home. Um, so I've got some time, I'm gonna go and do some fishing on the canal. I've had a little walk today, and I also had a little look um, Sunday, seen some massive blows. I think I found where the bream might be holding up. Um, certainly looks like it. The water is nice and chocolatey. We've had no real rain to cause that. It's all pure fish, I think. I think there's quite a big concentration of bream there. So, don't say this very often, but I'm off bream fishermen, fishing. Uh, been down to Carnvale Tackle Shop, met Paul. Um, bought some of the So Simple ground bait for the bream. I'm not sure exactly which one it is off the hand now, but She'll tell you later on when I'm there. I'm not far away now, so I'm gonna get there, set up. Um, there is rain forecast. I'm gonna fish into the night. Uh, say night, I'm gonna fish till about eight o'clock. So I've got a light, night light thing for my float. And I've got my quiver tip rod, so I'm gonna be using two rods. I've got a little um, hair rig for my feeder with um, artificial maggots and I should be putting some live ones on the hook. I'm going to fish it like I do with the tench. Um, I'm sure the bream will pick it up. I like a bit of that. Got loads of dead maggots. So, so I've got my ground bait, dead maggots, and live maggots, and I have got some worms. I'm going to get there. Just maybe just find where they are. There's quite a big stretch where, where they were blowing, so I don't think it's going to be too hard to find where they are. Um, yeah, so I'll get back to you. Hopefully we might have some fish on the bank this time round. I did go yesterday down the calm for an hour or so, but I didn't catch anything, so no video was made. Hopefully it'll be a different story today. Right, so see you in a bit. Right, so I've just got to a nice little spot. They're still, they're still blowing on the far bank. I've just chucked one ball of... Um, ground bait out. I'm going to stick some dead maggots out in a minute. I've just got to plummet my float, get the right depth on that, but feeder rods out on a bit that I've seen blowing. Um, yeah, I've got a cage feeder with the same sort of mix in. It is quite windy here at the minute. I might might end up regretting, regretting coming here this evening. Uh, here now, so fingers crossed. See a green. So I'm up and fishing now, so uh, both rods are out. Got two nice little spots baited up. So just waiting for a bite now. So the last time I come on the canal was December the 30th, I think, with the Chuckle Brothers. We had a little match between ourselves, which was a good fun, fun day out. Uh, Mr. Simon Joyce won that. Uh, so this is the first time out this year for me on the canal. I only bought the license a couple of days ago. Um, I might come again Saturday. I'm planning to come Saturday, but I think we're having a bit of a cold snap maybe um, happening in the next few days. I know there's going to be rain from later on tonight and tomorrow and first uh, the day will be now Tuesday, tomorrow, Thursday and Friday. Um, hopefully it doesn't get too cold because I'd love to come out again on the canal Saturday and do a, a nice nice day session but you can never tell with the weather but yeah so I've got both rods out wind's actually died down a little bit now so earlier on they were blowing right on the, the far far bank not seen any since I've uh, cast it out, but some bait out there now, so hopefully that might entice something along. Right, it's a sit and wait game now.
Oh. Oh, what have I done? Right. It's not the best move. There we go. Oh my god. As you can see, the way I'm falling around here, this bank it's not the most easiest bank to fish with, fish on. Gonna need my disgorger. There we go, first first fish. Lovely little bream. So here we go. My first little bream. I'll also show you so simple bait that I've been using in my feeder so that was my first cast on the feeder rod with a hair rig uh, two false red maggots and some live ones on the hook so that's a good start just, uh, he's been out long enough now let's get her back lovely let's hope they just get a bit bigger so I'll just show you my rig there's my little my cage feeder with uh, the so simple silver is it what's it called fine skimmer mix some dead maggots and then capped off with a hair rig like I said with my live maggots on the hook and some artificials on a little hair so let's cast this one back out and catch another one hopefully this time I hope I don't fall all over the place as you can see it's quite a steep bank here it's not the best conditions to fish Especially it seems I'm going to be here in the dark for a little while. Could be fun. There we go, all set for another one. I did miss a bite on my float earlier on. I did have one hooked on, but as I went to reel it in, it come off, not sure exactly what it was. That's good. All right, let's see what the weather's gonna be doing then. All right, five o'clock, 10%, six o'clock, seven o'clock, nine percent it's going to be raining soon before long the wind keeps getting picked up every now and then the brolly's getting bent bent sideways here uh, it's looking pretty wet for the rest of the, the night and the tomorrow by the looks of things I think there's a match here tomorrow I might be wrong I was talking to a, a guy fishing today I'm not sure whether he meant this stretch or a bit further down or where but good luck to that them tomorrow if it's going to be like that that won't be much fun well I'll be back working anyway anyway <laughs> well done Kev Well, I'm in two minds what to do at the minute. I mean, this wind keeps picking right up at the minute. And obviously the rain is forecast to come in the next hour. I'm considering, do I want to be sat here when the light goes with this wind and possible rain that's coming? All, the, all for the sake of uh, a fish. When I could be sat at home in the warm with me dog watching a bit of telly or something don't know what to do but it's a fair old chop on the water at the minute yeah and every now and then the gust and that that tree goes all over the shot 
don't know maybe half an hour and then rethink it's not as fast as I thought it might have been judging by what I had seen here earlier but we've had one Well, I am going to give it a miss. I'm going to pack it up. The rain has just started a little bit. It is quite blowy, although the bro brolly is looking a bit still at the minute. But at times I've had to really hold on to my brolly. There's a little bit bit of a low in the wind, so I'm going to pack up, clear off, because I've got a feeling it's just going to get worse at some point soon. So I'm going to get home, have something to eat, see my, see my dog, Fred, who hasn't been that well recently. So... He'll be he'll be happy to see me. So like I said, hopefully I'll be out on um, Saturday to give this a proper go during the, for a day session, weather permitting. So hopefully the weather's good for that. Anyway, see you all next time.